Hey there, YouTube fam. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're diving deep into the world of technology problem solving. If you've ever experienced Wi-Fi issues on your Windows 10 or 11 system, you're in the right place. I'm here to help you troubleshoot and fix those frustrating Wi-Fi problems once and for all. So, without further ado, let's get started. The first thing to do when facing Wi-Fi problems on Windows 10 or 11 is to go through some basic troubleshooting steps. 1. Check your Wi-Fi signal strength and make sure you're within range of your router. 2. Restart your router and modem to refresh the connection. 3. Restart your computer to ensure there are no temporary glitches causing the issue. Outdated or corrupted network drivers can often lead to connectivity problems. Here's how to update them. 1. Open the Device Manager by right-clicking the Start button and selecting Device Manager. 2. Expand the Network Adapters section right-click on your Wi-Fi adapter and select Update Driver. 3. Choose Search Automatically for updated driver software and let Windows find and install the latest driver. If you're still experiencing issues, you might need to reset your network settings. 1. Type Network Reset in the Windows search bar and open the Network Reset settings. 2. Click Reset Now and confirm the action. This will reset all network-related settings to their default configurations. After that, just restart the computer so that it can apply all the default setting. Windows has a built-in network troubleshooter that can diagnose and fix common issues. 1. Go to Settings Network and Internet Status. 2. Under Network Status, Click on Network Troubleshooter and follow the prompts. This will scan and troubleshoot if any missing updated or any issue is there in the driver or any bug. You can now close the window and go for the next troubleshoot. Click on Change Adapter option. Over there select the Wi-Fi adapter then right click on it. The Wi-Fi adapter should be always enabled. If you click on Disabled or it's already disabled, the adapter will turn off and you won't be able to connect to any Wi-Fi network. So make sure the Wi-Fi adapter is always enabled. Then you can connect to any seared Wi-Fi connection. So you can see the Wi-Fi adapter enabled and Wi-Fi is also is connected. If doing all these steps and still you're not able to connect, try connecting to a different Wi-Fi network to determine if the issue is with your network or the computer. There you have it, folks. A comprehensive guide on how to fix Wi-Fi problems on both Windows 10 and 11. We've covered basic troubleshooting steps, driver updates, network resets, and more. Remember, Technology hiccups are a part of life, but armed with these solutions, you'll be back online in no time. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel for more tech tips, and ring the notification bell so you never miss an update. Thanks for watching, and happy computing!